With breathtaking beaches and endless blue skies, Geraldton has long been a popular haven for tourists and West Australians alike. This modern city is renowned for its vast range of water-based activities. Experience the nearby Abrolhos Islands and discover Geraldton's intriguing maritime and Aboriginal history along the way. The magnificent HMAS Sydney 2 Memorial, completed in 2001, has become the country's premier site for honouring the 645 Australian sailors who lost their lives when their vessel was attacked by a German cruiser off the coast of WA during World War II. The memorial itself is extensive and boasts incredible views of the ocean, the city and the ranges. The HMAS Sydney 2 Memorial is a must-see for anyone visiting Geraldton. Take in Geraldton's history with a trip to the West Australian Museum. Overlooking the Indian Ocean, Geraldton's museum celebrates the rich heritage of the land, sea and people of the region. Enjoy a guided tour through the museum and hear stories of early shipwrecks and the discovery of the HMA Sydney 2, the pride of its fleet. The museum is also a great place to learn about the region's natural landscapes and marine environment. Marvel at St Francis Xavier Cathedral, one of the finest and most intricate works by famed architect Monsignor John Hawes. Construction of the cathedral began in 1916 and it took 22 years to build. Join a guided tour to get the most out of the experience. The striking interior of the building has to be seen to be believed. Follow the journey of the Western Rock Lobster from boat to dinner plate at Fisherman's Wharf. Gain a behind the scenes insight into the multi-million dollar rock lobster industry and why the clear Batavia waters of Geraldton are a haven for this seafood delicacy. There's even an opportunity to hold a live lobster, so make sure to bring your camera. Fisherman's Wharf is only five minutes drive out of Geraldton. It is well worth the visit. Iconic to Geraldton is the Point Moore Lighthouse, the oldest surviving Commonwealth lighthouse in Western Australia. The lighthouse is still in operation today and its beam can be seen 26 kilometres out to sea. The view of the crystal blue ocean from this lighthouse is stunning. The red and white stripes provide the perfect backdrop for a photo. For water related activities, Geraldton is the place to be. Known as the windsurfing capital of the country with its reliable daily sea breeze, the waters of Geraldton provide perfect conditions. Catch a wave at one of the many beaches, enjoy a leisurely stand-up paddleboard, have a go at kite surfing, or try your hand at fishing, snorkeling or diving. When it comes to the water in Geraldton, there really is something for everyone. Geraldton has a thriving arts and culture scene with several local galleries in town featuring works from local, national and international artists. This includes a range of local Aboriginal art, large-scale public works along the foreshore, and premium exhibitions at the Geraldton Regional Art Gallery. There's also a rich urban street art presence within the city centre. This adds to the vibrancy and the culture of the town. Just a 20 minute drive south of Geraldton is the town of Greniff. Step back in time and explore this historic settlement with buildings dating back to the 1860s. Or get up and close with Australian wildlife at the Greniff Wildlife and Bird Park. The leaning trees of Greenwich have become an icon for the area. Their horizontal trunks, formed due to the strong southerly winds of the region, create what seems to be something from another world. Explore the dramatic landscape of Okabella Homestead. Surrounded by rolling hills and ancient gorges, the region has a classically Australian landscape. Learn the story of this pioneer settlement turned farm that operates to this present day. Intriguingly, the Okabella homestead has been named one of Western Australia's most haunted locations, and people often claim to hear the sound of didgeridoos echoing through the surrounding hills. Just a 30 minute drive from Geraldton, the homestead is a captivating place to visit, both historically and visually. Take an Abrolhos Island scenic flight to view the 122 coral fringed islands located 60 kilometres to the west of Geraldton. Flourishing with natural wonders, these islands boast an extensive range of spectacular marine life, as well as Australian sea lions, bottlenose dolphins, 
migrating humpback whales and one of the world's most important sites for seabird breeding. Unique coral formations in the infamous Batavia shipwreck make for fascinating scuba diving and snorkelling. The islands are also home to a thriving crayfishing and pearl farming industry, as well as the oldest surviving building structure in Australia, Webby Hayes Fort. The shore excursions desk offers a range of tours to book before the ship arrives into Jordan. <laughs>